fall officially starts on Sunday. The summer heat is holding on for these last few days of the season, and we are tracking some changes ahead, but we're going to have to wait just a little while longer for them. So as I've been saying, we're in this rinse and repeat pattern where we're off in these cool and comfortable mornings, but then on into the afternoon, very sunny and very warm with temperatures that'll be above average once again. Live Guardian radar coin. We do have a few clouds on the eastern side of the state. This is keeping temperatures a little bit warmer out in areas like Muncie and Richmond. And if your travels will take you up I-69 into northeastern Indiana, do know that there is currently a dense fog advisory in place. Nothing like that here locally. Things very quiet. A nice easy start for us this morning weather wise. We're in this pattern where we have some showers off to the east coast and then off to the west into Kansas, Nebraska. We're seeing some showers out in that direction as well. And we're stuck here in the middle with high pressure and control and clear skies, rain free, and that's the pattern that we're going to stay stuck in for the next several days as well. We're at 59 degrees in Indy. We're at 60 in Muncie and 61 in Richmond, and we're at 52 in Lafayette. So you might want a sweater if you're heading out this morning, but again into the afternoon, you can go ahead, trade that in for a lighter option. By noon, we'll be in the upper 70s. This will already be just slightly higher than our average for this time of year. And then we climb into the mid 80s once again as we get into the late afternoon. As we get into the evening, clear skies overhead. Temperatures by 10 o'clock, we're in the mid 70s. And then tomorrow, I think we might be a degree or two warmer to start you off, but still a comfortably cool beginning to our day. And then on into the afternoon, we'll tack on a couple degrees to that high temperature as well, taking us into the upper 80s, staying dry tomorrow. We have additional burn bans that have been added to counties here in the state of Indiana. Now, Indiana has over three dozen counties under a burn ban, and many of those are here in central Indiana, like Shelby County, Bartholomew, Brown, Monroe County, Madison County, Park County, too. So we could see more of those added into the coming days. And even as we get our next system coming our way, it's going to have a hard time bringing rain to the surface. So you see we do have that moisture, the more humid conditions off to the west and to the east where we were tracking those showers, but we're stuck here in the middle with very dry air. So as rain starts to move our way, it encounters that dry air and it evaporates as it's coming to the surface. Futurecast wants to bring in a couple spotty showers Saturday and Sunday. I think we see just a few clouds. I don't think we get rain here at the surface, but we do have a better chance Monday and then an even better chance into Tuesday. So maybe a few spotty showers Monday, some widely scattered showers on Tuesday, something we'll at least be watching and hoping for. We're at 86 for a high today, 88 tomorrow and then 89 Friday and Saturday. More clouds over the weekend, but temperatures stay above average and we'll be watching those rain chances Monday and Tuesday of next week. Melissa.